this is a project description video for data Geek team so we will understand the first flow which is data cleaning and training part so here we will clean the data and train our model so first of all we imported our data set as a raw file and uh, done some kind of pre-processing in our training data after that we have made three copies of that we have exported that uh, first copy with all column then we have selected some uh, columns and then uh, we have exported that uh, we will use this exported data set for further visualization purposes after that uh, we have selected a uh, columns in which uh, we wanted to do a model training so we have selected location total square feet number of bathrooms uh, number of uh, bhks and uh, price will be the price will be your target column after that we have done one hot encoding and standardization of our variable after that we have used linear regression to train our model and uh, then after getting the result we have joined with our uh, original data set and uh, here we have exported our results. So this was the first flow. This is price recommender flow. Firstly, we import two data set, train data set and test data set. Here train data set is clean. Then we apply similar pre-processing process as we did for train data set in cleaning flow. Then we select relevant column that required for our model to predict. Then we add price column. Again, we import clean train data then we did feature scaling and feature generation using one hot encoding of location feature. Then we use linear regression method to predict house price. Using joint facet, we merge price column and all remaining feature column. Then we export final price predicted data. This is the test price predictor flow. The structure of this is SMS we have seen in the price recommender flow. So after running the flow, we have exported our result as a test data print. Then we purchase SVNIT test from the marketplace and then uh, imported our data uh, set as a test data print and then uh, run the flow and exported our result as a test data evolution. Now we will see some helper flows. So this is price distribution for dashboard. So basically we have imported our clean data set and the name of the location. Uh, and this flow will basically uh, recommend the price on a particular location, uh, which we will see in the dashboard. And this is flow to add the longitude and latitude data to create map box. This is our dashboard named Bangalore house price. At the top, we have made a flow map which shows the different steps of our process. The first step is raw data, where we have the housing features and its prices. Then we have made a pie chart where uh, it shows the BHK count by category. The second tab is free process data, where we have added the clean data and its prices. And we have made a map of Bangalore using the map box features. It shows, uh, shows the average house price of any particular location. The third tab is predictions, where we can compare the average actual versus the predicted price of the given data. And here we can see that we have got pretty accurate result for the houses with fewer number of rooms. Then we have the price recommender. Here the user can compare the average price per square feet of any particular location. Then choose the location from the locations table. Paste it here in the locations column. Add any unique house ID. Fill in the remaining details and click on the price recommender button. Then they'll get the predictions here. The last uh, tab is statistics tab where the user can enter their desired location and uh, see the description of houses with two BHK at that particular location.